Lord Harry. Enjoying the weather? I'll tell you what, Coldy. The sooner winter's over, the better. It takes so long to get a steam up in the morning. I'll agree with you there. And worst of all, I've got to take these passengers up to Boulder Summit of all places. Why can't they just walk there? I swear my funnel will freeze off one of these days. You should be grateful that you get to pull coaches, Lord Harry. <coughs> passengers are our coal and water, you know. I thought coal and water were our coal and water. Fizzling fireboxes. What's in that crate, Cranky? I don't know, Thomas. All I know is it's very heavy. Well, luckily, I'm the strongest engine on Super. Hey! Be careful! Oops. I guess I'm not as strong as you, Thomas. It was so cold the next morning, the steam engines could hardly move at all. I do wish my fire would stop going out. Any luck over there, Chang Tai? I have no steam at all. It's colder than the Himalayas this morning. You guys are making such a fuss over nothing. But I suppose I do have my super heat keeping me warm. I would have said it was conceit myself. How are you all today? I hope the weather isn't treating you too badly. Oh, I'm fine, sir. But I'm afraid the other, older engines are having a bit of trouble. Oof. Well, I'm sure you'll all be glad to know I've got a new engine to help you out. Me to all win. Alright, guys. Alwyn here will be helping out until the weather improves. Until then, sit tight. I'd best be off with the passenger train. See you all later. <laughs> Who does she think she is? There's no way she can manage all the coaches at once. What kind of engine is that anyway? She's coughing dark smoke from her funnel. She's a diesel engine. Well, Peter Sam told me about diesels whilst I was at the steamworks. Apparently, they don't work very well. Cool, oh, blimey. That's an awful lot of people. No trouble for me, though. Well, such an impressive locomotive. Better than those old steamers, I'd say. I didn't get restored just to sit around doing nothing while a Sneasel engine does all of my work for me. Aha! It's about time! Don't tell me you're going out in this weather, King Godred. Besides, Mr. Percival told us to stay here. I'll just take a quick train of empty trucks to the mine, fill them up, and bring them back. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> is damaged. I'll get the workman right away. I'll get the workman right away. I've had <laughs> Back so soon? I'm getting the workman's train. The bridge at Shallow is damaged. But King Godred is still out on the line. Workman inspected the damaged bridge and put up signs to warn everyone of the danger. Meanwhile, King Godred was making his way back towards the bridge. Eh? What is that? Oh, I cracked my crown! Ooh. Oh. Stay right there, King Godred. It's not like I have much of a choice! Oh. <laughs> Keep pulling!
thank you so much! If it wasn't for you, I'd be back on the scrap heap! No problem. No problem. Soon, the weather started to get warmer, and the steam engines could bubble their boilers again. Have a great day, guys. You too. Stay safe, my good Kiesel friend. So at last, the steamies and diesel could be really useful together. <laughs>